Here's something for you to think about. You want to turn the steering wheel quickly in slow corners and slowly in fast corners. Yes, it's a bit of a generalization, but it's not a bad guide for you to think about. You know, when you're coming up to a slow, tight corner, you need to get the car to rotate a lot. When I talk about rotating, I'm thinking about, you know, if you were looking down on the top of your car, you need to change direction or rotate very quickly. And that's what I'm talking about when I, when I say rotate the car. To do that, you can need to turn the steering wheel a little more quickly. But in fast corners, where you want the car to arc its way through the corner as opposed to rotating it through the corner, and where you want to maximize the overall grip of the car by keeping the car as balanced as possible, you want your turning to be much slower and more deliberate, uh, more of an arc through the corner. And, and that's why I say you want to turn the steering wheel slower in those fast corners to keep the car better balanced. Like I said, in those slow corners, you maybe need to use that weight transfer to kind of help rotate the car a little bit. And that's why, as a general rule, you turn the steering wheel quickly in the slow corners and, and slowly in the fast corners, as a guide.